In this video, I'm going to show you how you can make this model here. And this is a surface board. We're going to make it as a solid with the bar surfacing. So in the beginning, I'm going to create a tours. So here's my um, options. So I can just adjust it a little and get my subject mode and increasing the major segments <clears throat> okay maybe we have here okay 30 is good and maybe a little bit up on the manner segments all right now at last i'm going to select this option here so it's going to be rotation offset to make it linear with the trade here okay now i'm going to take from this let me take let's say the right plan or it's going to be the back plan i'm going to select those here as you see and I'm going to reverse the selection. Now I have selected my faces, just delete this and you got similar or something quite close to this part. Now as you see here, we have on the bottom something like a hard creased edge. So I'm going to hard crease this one. right now second is I'm going to insert a couple of edges here and I'm going to graze them I'm going to increase all of these maybe 35 select of those and get down a little bit so now we got the second detail here and it's uh, this one maybe it's just wider here so we can get to the top view and select this guy move it a little bit further and this one here and this one here all right so now it's just wider like the image now we have this edge here Maybe select stop at corners and select your edge move it slightly like this right now for here we are very close to, to finish this you have this slender so if I just get this view you can see that my port is a little bit um, staying or maybe semi flat we just need to make it a little bit bendy so I'm gonna bend it a little with the soft selection I'm gonna increase my soft selection here and let's see first increase a little and something like this and from the bottom here like this all right so I think that's good now quickly go to the inserting tools here and create a slender and I'm going to select the slender as it's look like this and I'm gonna crease this two edges so now I have a flat slender you scale it down a little move it to the center and make it a little bit taller so it's just uh, looks like it's in this place here and it's need to be a little bit bigger all 
All right. And here is our cylinder. Now, I can do two options here. Number one option is I can hide this slender and then I'm going to select this body and thicken it and go to maybe minus one millimeters. All right. Then I'm going to give my body the second one. Let's make sure it's just wider like the other board. Okay. And here is a two solid bodies. Go to converting now. You can convert it. Okay. And then I'm going to select this face, go to surface, surface offset, and offset as zero. Okay. Now take Futures, Split, and use the Trim Tools. I'm going to use my opposite surface. And select this body and cut. I'm going to select it. I'm going to select this body. I need to cut it and consume cut bodies here. And select. Okay. So now you have um, this board here removed now I can hide this surface offset okay and I can go to futures combine and combine these two bodies okay so I have now all the words combine it what about if I just need this to be shell it so I'm going to go back, edit, let me just remove this combine, All right, and I'm going to make a copy of this. All right, then Combine Maybe use subtract and this is the main body Let's remove this one to see and it's just Got it here as you see Now I'm gonna re Put it like this And I can choose common. That will um, leave only this guy here. So what I want is to make a cut inside here. So how I can do this. <clears throat> is going to easily by shelling this. I just press shell here at one millimeters and press OK. Right. Then I'm going to go to combine, add, and merge these together. And now you have this part show it and I can go to the fillet and make my fillets. If I just do this fillet here and apply and another fillet on here. Okay. And I can cut this. 
let's make a cut here we use any dimension which is 30 millimeters future extruded cut all right so here we go here we have your part and <clears throat> the recycle looks great i can go here and add a material let's try the chrome and as you see everything looks great and this is a solid body so that's how you can do this port it's just a shell it we can make the same by before going to this shell what you're gonna do is inserting a sketch on the top plane maybe just make it a little bit up and sketch on this plane here and I'm going to select like this okay futures extrude and the extrude maybe um, it's maybe 15 or something okay and now use the shell let's reshell it delete this shell and use shell again We just added the sketch direction two. Okay, yes. Use shell, and I'm gonna cut this face one millimeters. Okay. Now, adding the combine, let me just adjust it. And here is my fillets again. remove the scott extrude oh I can see that I have to show I have to fill it this one here and this one here okay now we are all good let's hide them all and here is your part So I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and see you later.